Welcome to Antenna and Wave Propagation Playlist. Here, in this session, I'll be going to explain pattern multiplication of four point sources. So, first of all, I'll explain what is that which we do in pattern multiplication. So, with the help of pattern multiplication, it is possible to sketch antenna radiation pattern almost by inspection and where we can find radiation pattern so fast. So this is what quick method to have radiation pattern for antenna array. So here in this session I will be explaining pattern multiplication of four point sources. So let us have this example where we have four isotropic source and that is been separated by distance lambda by 2. So for this case we are going to have a radiation pattern. So here one can clearly see there are four point sources 1, 2, 3, 4. So when we want to calculate pat resultant pattern of these four point sources all we do is we consider a group of elements and then after we calculate individual patterns like see in this example we will be considering group of 1 and 2 point so I will consider group of 1 and 2 and I will consider group of 3 and 4 so group pattern of 1 and 2 that will be resulting into pattern of X so this will be resulting into pattern of X and group of 3 and 4 elements that will be resulting into pattern of Y and now if you see the distance in between these two then that distance now would have changed to lambda so then after we will be doing a calculation of pattern of X and Y to have a resultant pattern of this pattern of 1, 2, 3, 4 elements. So here first of all we will be calculating unit pattern of 1 and 2 that is what a pattern of X. So let us do it step by step so it will be more clear. So pattern of X that is group pattern of 1 and 2. So here if you observe 1 and 2 group. So 1 and 2 that is apparted by distance lambda by 2. So for a distance apparted by lambda by 2 pattern that is having nulls at angle 0 degree and at angle 180 degree. So you will be finding pattern of this will be like this. So this will be the pattern of X as well as this will be the pattern of Y. So now as I have told now we have pattern of X and Y that is this. Now resultant pattern is a pattern of X and Y. So resultant pattern that will be a pattern of unit pattern of X or Y into group pattern of X and Y. So resultant pattern that is unit pattern of X or Y into group pattern of X and Y. So we have unit pattern of X and Y, X or Y so that we have calculated that is for distance in between two element lambda by two so that is this so ultimately unit pattern of x or y that is having nulls at zero 
and 180 degree and that pattern will look like this so this is what unit pattern of x or y now into group pattern of x and y that is what we are going to calculate about now here if you see group of x and y so that is apparted by distance lambda so for distance apparted by lambda pattern that will be having nulls at 60 degree and 120 degree and to understand that I have already calculated that radiation pattern you can see my previous video from that you can easily find how to have a calculation of pattern for elements apparted by distance lambda so if elements are apparted by distance lambda for group pattern of x and y then nulls will be at 60 degree and 120 degree so nulls that will be there at 60 degree and 120 degree so ultimately group pattern of x and y now that will be like this and multiplication of these two pattern that will be resulting into resultant pattern and this is group pattern of x and y so multiplication of these two pattern that will be resulting into resultant pattern now how to calculate resultant pattern so when you plot resultant pattern first of all you just show all those nulls which is there in both of the patterns the reason is anything into zero nulls means zero so anything into zero that will result into zero so first of all show all the nulls which is there in that pattern so here nulls for first pattern that is there at 0 and 180 so first of all show nulls at 0 and 180 degree and then in second pattern nulls are there at 60 and 120 degree so let us show it it is there at 60 degree as well as it is there at 120 degree so this is where nulls will be there so ultimately now maxima into maxima will be maxima but maxima into minima will be nulls so here at this direction 90 degree both are having maxima so there will be maxima as well as in this direction there will be maxima and here nulls are there so pattern that will be having nulls at that angle so just make a small lobes so that will gives you idea about how resultant pattern will look like so whenever you plot pattern by using pattern multiplication you just take a unit pattern then take a group pattern and multiply both that will result into resultant pattern and when you plot it you just show all those nulls which is there in both of the patterns so here in this pattern nulls are there at 180 degree as well as 0 degree and in this pattern nulls are there at 60 degree and 120 degree so plot all those nulls and then maxima into maxima is maxima so this is maxima and then for smaller angles you just show it by smaller lobes so resultant radiation pattern of four point source that will be this so for this element arrangement resultant radiation pattern will be this so that is how one can identify resultant pattern thank you so much for watching this video you can suggest me those videos which is required to complete antenna and wave propagation playlist by commenting over here you can see my website engineeringfunda.co.in and for that link is been placed in description of this video 
you just go through it you will be finding all those materials which is required to understand antenna and wave propagation playlist and where you will be finding other subjects even which i have offered over here on youtube so you can access all those materials as well as subject from my website so please go through it and you will be finding it it is very interesting my job is to make engineering easy so probably now by accessing website one can see all those materials which is there with my explanation on youtube thank you so much for watching this video keep watching keep sharing with your friends thank you